instead of just talking about how to have justice or charity at the end of the economic process, how do we create justice and generosity and opportunity primarily through work in the way that we do business, in the way that we engage with the marketplace. Work and, and having a job is at the heart of participation in the community. Work is what takes someone who has formerly been destroying the community and turns them into a productive citizen. We like to believe that second chances create a better employee force, that if you have another opportunity, uh, that you'll, you'll be a stronger, more dedicated, loyal uh, employee by virtue of us believing in that person and stepping up and taking a stance and helping them out. It helps us to uh, grow and develop as an as a organization, as a team, and it also allows us to be an active part in the community where we are investing into the city of Memphis. All of us have an obligation to understand how our particular work our particular vocation supports the community as a whole, and particularly the poor. It's a solution that begins with the church and with God's people living their vocation in light of what God calls us to economically. And that sacrifice and generosity in creating opportunities for work and ownership in the way we do business, and what we do with the money we make from business, and the way our businesses work together within the community, the whole equation. That's what God cares about. That's His guidelines for us. Advanced Memphis is and has been extremely relational. We all, deep down, we desire community, we desire relationships, we desire friends. You're going to find in all of your interaction and what you hear from us, it's going to be relationships. We are building relationships with our neighbors um, in the Claiborne and Foote community, in the business community, with the local church, and we are connecting all of that. And the best way to do that is just through building a relationship, and I think it takes away the hierarchy of of helping, you know, I think when you give things, you say that I have and you don't have, you know, versus a relationship is saying we're both coming into this and we're giving and taking from each other. We believe in working together and that uh, we want to commit uh, to them and help them out in, in a lot of different ways and we do that on a personal level and we believe that it helps us as a better company. We like to give them the comfort and the ability that, look, we've all made mistakes, we've all had hardship, but we open the door, we want you to start and be a part of our family. When we see charity work or whatever, it's like this one group of people is going to go and help this group of people, but I just saw so much intermingling. And I think that was just something I'd never really seen before, just in any type of nonprofit. So that really prompted me to want to get more involved. And so through that, I came and I decided to be a champion. One of the biggest things that I've learned from them is just perseverance. Perseverance, you know, when you get pushed back, you know, what step do I need to take to move forward? Mm -hmm.